It's time now for Sunday Brunch, and joining us this morning is Chef Bernard Smith from The Grand. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Well, I'm fine, and this is certainly a grand presentation. What are you making for us today? Thank you very much. I've bought some really special treats today. I have prepared for you a lobster filo timbal mm -hmm. with a little lobster sauce, some poached asparagus. Wow. And with uh, a garnish of... Um, finely diced uh, tomato. This looks gorgeous. So how do we get going on making this? What is this before us here? Okay, this is filo dough, which mm -hmm. is almost like uh, tissue paper. So it tends to dry out. You can't make it at home. You tend to want to buy this product okay. here. Okay, I've seen it in the freezer section all the time. So you've put some butter on top of it. Yeah, so I moisten it with some butter. I fit it into the, uh, the cup. Where do you buy those cups? I've had a hard time locating cups like those. Those are the little ramen cups. Ramekin cups. Ramekin can, cups. Yeah, that's ramekin it. cups. You can generally purchase um, hmm, any type of home goods supply okay. store should have it. Just um, need to look in the right spot. Now yeah. you're cutting up the lobster so I'm, there. So I'm, I'm taking the lobster. I'm taking the lobster that's been uh, quickly poached in my water here. So you can add aromatics mm -hmm. to, the, to this dish here by putting uh, bay leaf, thyme, a little garlic. Uh, just to good. add some flavor to the lobster, I've. Um, Those are nice, healthy chunks. I'll take too. the lobster and put it in as a base. Mm -hmm. I'll add some egg product here. Yeah, just like the liquid eggs. Just a little liquid yep, egg. Just to cover it. Just to cover it. Mm -hmm. Right. So now we're pretty much set here. Okay. I'll uh, fold, it, fold it. In? Fold it down. Is there a special folding way, or you just smush it all in there? Just fold it down. The important thing is to not have any holes okay. in the filo, so that the eggs. Don't oh, sort yeah, of disperse into out. the cup. Okay. And then this is all ready to bake mm -hmm. and go into the oven. And how long will it bake for? That should take no more than about seven minutes. Okay. And then, ooh, seven minutes went by. Take a look at this. <laughs> bada bing, bada boom. That looks gorgeous. So there's our finished product. Oh my a gosh, it's delicious. Egg timbal with um, actually I have a little bit of cheese in there. Mm -hmm. that I oh, what kind of cheese did you but put in there? But cheese will add a little herb product, mm -hmm. and it'll add a little bit of uh, just another layer of flavor. All right, now what else do you have going on over here? Okay, over here is where all the excitement is happening. In uh huh. Addition. Here I have more excitement. Don't trip. I almost slipped. Here I have, I have my asparagus. Right. They look here, gorgeous. which I've cut a little bit mm -hmm. on the bias and peeled the uh, the outer tough body, the outer layer skin. Mm -hmm. I've prepared um, a lobster stock. So okay, my lobster stock amazing. is, if you want to prepare this at home, mm -hmm. it's, a, it's white wine, um, garlic. Uh, actually, I have a, a whole lobster over here. So if you have mm. the whole lobster, you could use the shell of the lobster oh. um, with a little white wine, garlic, saute those with a little oil, wow. um, deglaze with your white wine, mm -hmm. add your cream, and reduce. That looks great. And you'll have a really flavorful product. And this Yummy. is something wow. we're going to pour over the asparagus. And we want to tell people if you'd like a copy of today's recipe, just log on to our website, WBALTV.com, and click on food, or you can send us a self addressed stamped envelope, and we will send you that recipe right back. And so we can find all of uh, the, these recipes and more at the Grand. Absolutely. And Good the Grand job. is located? The Grand is located at 2200 um, Charles, St. Charles Street. All awesome. right. Good job.